I'm going to show you how to use Dulato's lead forms. So you'll start by clicking on clients and then click on lead forms. You can create multiple lead forms for different types of clients that you might serve, such as birth or postpartum or lactation. So you'll start by clicking on new lead form here and give it a title. Then you can click on it to edit the details. And it also has the link to copy, so you can paste that into your social media profile, your website, your email footer, wherever you need that. And there's also an embed code if you need that as well. Every lead form starts with some basic information and then you can customize it. So I'll go ahead and show you how to customize. This will bring you to our lead form editor where you can add different questions, different sections, um, anything you might need in your lead form. You can also delete items if you don't want that in there, like say you don't want their birth date in there for some reason, you can go ahead and delete that. Then you can add a new section by clicking on section and give it a title. And you can add questions here. You can decide if you want it to be required or not as well. The responses to these questions can go certain places in your client profile. So that's what map to means. And I will show you where that ends up in just a moment. When you are done editing, you can hit save. Then I'll show you what that lead form looks like. So when your prospective client clicks on that link, this is what the form will look like. It has all of the questions that you added and it will show which ones are required. And then I'll show you what a completed lead form looks like. Once somebody fills out your lead form, you'll be notified by the little red notification number up here. When you click on clients, you can see your new lead. That will stay red until this client turns to an active client or inactive or archived. You can edit that by clicking on edit here and change their status. All of the information that they filled out will be in this client profile here. So this is their contact information. And then those sections that said map to either notes or custom fields, those end up down here for notes and on the right hand side for custom fields. You can also click on edit here and you can change this around if you would like to. If you want that at the bottom, you can do that. Then you can always come back to the clients tab and go to lead forms if you need to edit anything or add additional lead forms.